and welcome to my weekly weigh-in series every Sunday morning. I want it to be morning. I want to do these Sunday mornings, but I just can't get up in time to do these in the morning. It's afternoon. I'm still trying to get going. It's one of those days where brain is thinking, oh yeah, let's get going. Yeah, woohoo. We got all these cool things to do and all this, all this neat stuff and, and got planned and my body's like, I all have the days like that where brain is like, yeah, let's run, let's run, let's run. And bodies, meh. Yeah, right now, that, that fist bump, that just, that just, I just don't feel like it. my body just doesn't want to move. Brain's running, brain's running, but bodies just no. But anyway, uh, let's go ahead and get to the weigh in. Pretty good weigh-in. Um, it's always good to be under 330. But uh, let's go ahead and go over the numbers. Um, my waist is at uh, 53 and a half, which was last week. And uh, that's not a whole lot of change from week to week. It's, it's kind of what I expect on waist. Uh, it's, uh, it's just kind of what happens. Um, good to see it's trending downwards. I think I got to 52 and a half once the last couple weeks. But uh, I'll take it. Um, weight this week is 327 even, which is down from 331.5 last week, which last week, uh, was coming back from vacation and, um, raised a bit and was because I was just not moving. And I was kind of nervous about this week because, uh, Thanksgiving I was on Thursday and it was a couple days ago and I didn't really eat all that much on Thanksgiving. I did have seconds. But uh, I did manage to stay away from um, your and grandpa's uh, mashed potatoes, and um, they had um, chicken and noodles and uh, homemade noodles. They, their chicken and noodles are good, but um, I just don't do those anymore. Um, and I was able to stay away from those and cranberry sauce and um, just stuck to the ham and green bean casserole. And mom bought uh, brought a um, um, roast beef. So yeah, and she had a made a, a gravy with a, I think she called it xanthan gum instead of flour. So that was pretty good. Um, it was really good, good really good gravy. But um, yeah, the, the, a lot of people say, well, I was losing weight until Thanksgiving happened and you just kind of because of all the stuff you eat. And um, the, one, the one thing about Thanksgiving is uh, the poor turkey, um, it gets a lot of... Uh, crap because it makes you feel bad because um they say it has um tryptophan in it the thing though is people are starting to find out the big after dinner crash then just general nap time after after eating thanksgiving dinner is actually for the um carb crash because if you eat a lot of carbs your body's gonna release a lot of insulin and the reason um Recovering from the insulin spike is is a, a energy crash. So if you eat a lot of bread and stuffing and sugary desserts, um, you will feel tired after eating those. So I did manage to avoid those, and I wasn't tired after Thanksgiving dinner. And it was kind of kind of interesting to see everybody in zombie mode because you know that. That turkey has a tryptophan in it. Doing a little bit of research, it looks like chicken and eggs have just as much tryptophan in them as turkey does. So, do you eat chicken and just pass out because tryptophan is in the birds? But no, it's and cheese has tryptophan in it. So, uh, the massive crash after Thanksgiving dinner, that's really more for the carbs than because of that tor turkey. Um... Yeah, sidetracked a little bit. But uh, BMI this week is 40.9, and uh, last week it was 41.4, which is down 0.5 on the BMI. Um, so, yeah, um, had a successful and happy Thanksgiving, and uh, did stick to uh, me and had the green bean casserole and enjoyed the company of, uh, of family. So, uh, it's a good Thanksgiving. And uh, 
got got moving more because I got back to work and um that uh yeah um sticking to that uh, keto diet because you yeah, know sticking away staying away from the mashed potatoes and um homemade uh, chicken and noodles that uh yeah um looking forward to Christmas but, uh, anyway um yeah uh but that's still like a month off so it's people just like constantly um in going to Christmas stuff because uh um thinking about uh, all the, the the sweets and uh, cookies and chocolates and stuff um and then then oh well we we gain holiday weight you know how that holiday weight comes on you can't do anything about the holiday weight when you're constantly eating cookies and and fudges and stuff like that it's like hey, you can you can help that but anyway um it's uh, getting ahead of myself uh, that that lecture is coming on later in the, <laughs> that, that, that lecture is a whole month away but anyway um thanks for watching um this is uh, sunday sunday weigh-ins and uh yeah, um, I'll waste you sidetracked in that middle there. Uh, have a nice day.